मूविंग ऑन टू नाइन्थ क्वेश्चन ए हीप ऑफ वीट इज इन द फॉर्म ऑफ ए कोन हुज डायामीटर इज टेन पॉइंट फाइव मीटर्स एंड हाइट इज थ्री मीटर्स फाइंड इट्स वॉल्यूम द हीप इज टू बी कवर्ड बाई द कैनवास टू प्रोटेक्ट इट फ्रॉम रेन फाइंड द एरिया ऑफ कैनवास रिक्वायर्ड नाउ मूविंग ऑन टू सोल्यूशन ही सेस द हीप ऑफ वीट इज इन द फॉर्म ऑफ कोन लेट एस कंसिडर द फिगर एज शोन इन हियर द डायामीटर ऑफ द हीप is given as 10.5 meters let us convert this into the radius r which will be equal to half of the diameter that is half of 10.5 meters that is nothing but 5.25 meters similarly the height of the heap is also given which is 3 meters he asks us to find the volume as as heap is in the form of cone the volume of heap will be equal to volume of cone that is 1 by 3 pi r square h which is equal to 1/3 of pi value is 22 by 7 and r square is nothing but 10.5 into 10.5 by 4 into h is 3 meters here 7 goes in 10.5 One point five times, and three goes in three one time, which is equal to that is equal to three forty six point five centimeter cube. He asks us to find the area of canvas required to cover the heap. That is nothing but the curved surface area. We have the curved surface area of cone as pi r l. So here. we need to initially find the l that is nothing but the slant height which is given by square root of r square plus h square that implies l is equal to square root of r square that is 5.25 whole square plus h square that is 3 square that is equal to square root of 36.5625 that is approximately 6.05 meters here we also got this land height that is 6.05 meters here we need to find the area of canvas required to cover the heap which is the curved surface area of the cone that is pi r l that is 22 by 7 into 10.5 by 2 into length into slant height that is nothing but 6.05 which is equal to here 7 goes in 10.5 1.5 times and 2 goes in 22 11 times finally we get 11 times 1.5 times 6.05 is 99.825 cm2